Yes, they do indeed. Now, Team Spirit. Magic's right here. Gonna be holding down short, finds the headshot on the boom, but she's gonna try to find what's going on in the B apartments. But oh, the timing, not really good on the turn right there. Now, they currently in full control of the B site, so they will be able to put down bomb down. Does look like they will be looking for some frags. Bit here, together with electronic, gonna have a crossfire, but they have to find all the frags right here because they're playing quite aggressive once one trade comes in but oh, no. bit is gonna whiff simple though with the p to 50 he's gonna find two right here one versus three for simple can he do this no mirror is gonna run over him and that will be the first round one by spirit and navi and it's looking very worrying for navi especially as simple as taking things so slowly 35 seconds simple hasn't found a frag on the ak and that is about to change as he rips the head off of magic so now the b bombs and executives come straight back on in Mir finds electronics in the apartment. The bomb gets dropped. Boomich comes into trade. And now the three versus three. The bomb will get denied, but simple as there to pick up the pieces. Can he find another one? It's now the IGL has left to plant the bomb. This is looking like vintage simple at this point. Two versus two, but Navi got a bit of an advantage right now. But oh, Ooh. Chopper is going to come in. Finds a girl to simple. Boomich now in the one versus one. And Dexter comes out ahead, finds the headshot. And with that, finds a second round for Team Spirit. Hopefully drawing a flashbang towards B to announce their entrance as you will. Magic though with the MP9 finds the entry. Electronic with the Trado. And Mir attack simple down as well. Oh, Electronic been absolutely great in this round. And also great lately. A huge part of Navi's recent success. But now, gonna find his third kill. Boombage. 100 HP, but Electronic is praying in there. Do you to throw a molly? But Boombitch has to cross. He's going to have a smoke, but isn't going to throw it there to, in front of his cross. That is interesting because Chopper is holding on, and Boombitch is going to find a kill. Sonda Young with a trade, but you would have thought that Boombitch would have used that smoke to cross there. Yeah, I don't know why the hell he doesn't use it to just cross to the bomb site. That is baffling decision making by the IGL. Electronic, though. That's a risky plant and a half. He times it perfectly, but that peak, that swing, a little less so. Oh, and it had, a, had to have been electronic to find a 4K in round number three. It's just not going to happen. Sung Dae Young doubles up. Edge his way over to a better angle to deal with Perfecto here. Perfecto's not had a great time of it lately. This would definitely be a great game for him to show up into, but Sung Dae Young immediately denies. Oh my goodness, the 2K looking for a third. Bit down to just 31 points of health and with 35 seconds left on the clock. Navi, they're running away from this B-bomb site. Let's look at Boomich. He's taken all the space on A. Chopper, though, he hears his rotation, picks up by an electronic, jumping on up high, and now it's all down to Bitten Boomich. But Chopper, he's coming in behind the bomb carry. It'll take just a couple of bullets to connect, and he will go down. 15 seconds left on the clock, and Boomich, why are you pushing that far? Oh my goodness, it's a drastic round from Navi. Team Spirit now in a 5 versus 3. Nice. A good headshot there from Perfecto onto Sun Dayong to keep things a little bit more even. Simple, scoping in and out like a maniac. Does find another. Electronic on the Desert Eagle finds Chopper. And now a winnable 3 versus 3. Could I be proven wrong for the first time in about 4 days, White? I would love to see it. And Perfecto. He swings in towards short. There's not much time left for the plant now. If Mir goes for the swing, that could be the end of him, though, as Perfecto holds the angle. A 2k in the round for him. Simple finding magics means it's all down to Dexter on the AWP now in the one versus two. Hey, guys. See? Every time Sneaky has been saying four deagles and a scout didn't work, I was always there against him. Being like, but Sneaky, it works out just good. No, just kidding. I was always so against him. <laughs> uh <laughs> Dexter now gonna fade to the defuse. He's gonna find one, but gets straighted out by Perfecto. And the Ford Eagles and the Scout will finally work out, but yeah. Now the peaking comes for top mid. No bullets fired just yet. Boomich goes for a spam down towards the window, but it's mere to open things up as Bit will fall in the underpass. Perfecto unable to trade, and the grenade is too late to deal any damage to him. And he's actually going back for more now. And it's Magix with a grenade on Zaboomich. Dexter on the orb to remove Simple. And now a two versus five for Na'Vi. After winning the four Deagle and Scout by round. Electronic. Looking to go towards middle. There is a player boosted up in short. Though. That is Magix. Find a kill. Doesn't fall back. 
Maybe should have, but in the end, doesn't matter too much. Perfecto finds a kill, but now, and, and going glasses forward, and Dexter gonna kind of miss as well. Perfecto, pretty being allowed a lot of room, but in the end, would be amazing. Well, more than amazing if he would win this. Yeah, I mean, it's a bit of a weird round to be losing in a fashion like this. Only a single kill for Navi in round number six. On the push, and Perfecto is holding this one down. Now the question is, Perfecto finds the kill into Magisk. Gets ding down 10 HP now, the nade down to 7, but Dexter, he's in no position to push this one. Oh, smoke was used already, so if that molly bounced off the wall, it would have killed Perfecto. He stays alive, and in the meanwhile, Navi going towards his A-Sight Chopper. Gets cut off guard, and now some die young. He may die young here. Electronic's actually on one point of health at the moment, which is uh, always great to see. It may be a... Oh, no. Boomage! He's going to double up! That's a huge double from Boomage! Now all down to Mir, and look at how low three of these Na'Vi players are. Less than a bullet would be enough to deal with all of them. Near impossible retake, especially since it's only Na'Vi's second on the board. This does give Na'Vi a chance to breed, though. The fast they execute could be catching them straight off guard. They've read this perfectly. Boomage on the MAC-10, his signature weapon, it would seem, jumps into the site. And he oh. isn't going to check behind him, but Magix whiffs every shot. And Boomage gets out of the situation just fine. They lose the orb sometime young. That was a cheeky Zeus, but it's just not going to be enough. As Chopper's last alive, he does take down Simple, but it's a one versus three for him now. This may be a bit too much of an ask, Ooh. but oh, finds another headshot. Two kills so far in this round without losing a single digit of HP, especially with a P250 and no armor. That is something impressive, but Bit is going to take him out in the end. But even yeah. so, it, it's just not looked like a good map for them lately. It's still their worst rated, a 40% win rate after 12 maps played. Some down a bit, trade headshots. They are going into a four versus four as that timer ticks on down. Still over a minute and 10 on the clock, though. But Chopper. Absolute nuisance hiding behind the smoke finds Perfecto. We'll get spammed on down and electronic with the swing. That is perfect. Sub die young though. Find simple and now three versus two will continue. Yeah, bit. While you're in the jungle, make sure that they will be able to cross, but Sub die young, he doesn't care about no mollies. Just gonna run straight into it. And now electronic in a one versus three, but Mir is gonna take him out and denies him. Now, the challenge may even get more difficult. Here is going to take out Perfecto and Navi now in a 3 versus 5. Electronic holding on the jungle. This kind of spot the player in the back, but doesn't quite find a kill. And Chopper right here. Oh, that is a bit unfortunate for him. Simple is going to catch him off guard, but now Navi still in a 2 versus 3. Simple going to plan to bomb, but now the timing has to be great for him now. Looked like a player from short may have catched him off guard there, but he didn't. Just in time. It's about time for the time to go. Well, for Na'Vi, but Simple finds Dexter. Like Tony takes out Sumdai Young. And now Magic in a one versus two. Can he pull this one off? Simple oh, no. is just going to switch to the clock. <laughs> he knows he is on low HP and finds a headshot. Third gun in the round and the fifth round for Na'Vi. But yeah, Sumdai <laughs> Young, I think, yeah, he was at 15 or 16 kills. Did just say that actually. Uh, Chopper here in Sandwich is going to find one, but Boombitch with a trade. Down to LV, 11 HP though. Until the being thrown in bit is gonna get the bomb down, but it has to be careful. I mean, some die young. Bit of smoke there, you won't quite see that he hasn't had his crosshair straight on him, but the lineup was definitely there, and Dexter is gonna find a kill on the Perfecto through the gap of the smoke. Team Spirit in a four versus three retake scenario. Can they make this happen right here? Simple. Currently, Underwood is not going to find anything, and now Bit and Boombitch, they're in a lot of trouble. The bomb currently in a smoke, but Mir takes out Bit and Boombitch now. One versus four. It's time to run for the hills. Yeah, that means Team Spirit have won themselves to half. Boombitch doesn't want to stick around. Uh, they didn't have a defuse kit, I don't think. Will they be even able to clear out this bomb site? Electronic is going to try from the ramp position, and Simple... He starts things off nicely. Dexter will fall the opposition orper. 
Unable to find much as Boomich holds the cross. Will they clear out Chopper's position though? If Chopper swings this, he's going to get a freebie onto Electronic. Spams the other way. Realizes that the flank is imminent, but Perfecto finds a frag. So to simple. Mir now in a one versus three in the last round of the half. He goes for the box spam, but won't be successful. Two players incredibly low health here though. It's still a possibility on the retake if he finds a head of Perfecto, but no, Boomich will swing. Mir will fall, and it's an 8 7 half for Spirit on their opponent's map pick. It's a very, very closely contested game so far. We are not responsible for you losing your money. And neither are the teams, because they are trying their best. Oh. And so is simple as he finds a gorgeous headshot to start things off and grabs the bomb in top middle. Finally traded out by Magics, but now three versus four. They have to retrieve the bomb. Bits on the ball this time and finds a head of Magics. Two versus four. Sunta Young and Chopper. Oh, well, now just Chopper. As Sunta Young gets... His cranium bashed in by the lead of bit. This is going to be too little too late. Can still find some kills, but it's currently two players in connector. One going into window. This is going to be a hard one. Goes down to electronic and boom, but Janat was going to make it 8-8. Eight eight. Now that also feels like it was just yesterday that it got changed, but I do believe that was like a year ago. Oh, well. Mir is going to find the opener onto bit. Once again, Na'Vi with one less player, and that may be two in a second. Magics out of connector, using that smoke to his advantage. Oh, Electronic gonna get flashed by Sunday Young, and oh. Magics absolutely popping up right here. Three beautiful kills, and Perfecto, what you gonna do right now, my man? Well, under normal circumstances, I'd have no problem going, yeah, that's gonna be a 2-0 to Na'Vi, but in recent weeks, they've looked so sloppy. I feel like the same can be said for a lot of Tier 1 teams. Especially after things like the player break, because Liquid, they won a Grand Slam, they come back, and they're looking like one of the worst teams in North America. Now, Boomich. Not looking too bad, as Electronic doubles up with him. Mir finds a kill with a molly and swings on in, decapitates the IGL, as Sunda Young does the same bit now, down to him, 1v1, and it's going to be Mir to swing on him with a 4k! That's a huge round from him! Well, on a map that relies so heavily on aim as well as utility, having such a weaker weapon going into engagements is never a good sign. Electronic deals with Mir quite nicely, though. And my opinions on the economy, I feel like the fact that T's could, in theory, buy five AKs after the pistol round is a little bit obscene. And uh, I don't know. I think the economy does need a little bit of tweaking. I also think that overtime should be a <laughs> Jesus Christ almighty simple and electronic but now this crossfire could be huge as well. Simple and Electronic in his crossfire against 18 seconds of the team spare clock. But Electronic, yeah, the spit. What? Crossfire. He just comes in and peeks and could be it. The Simple here finds two. Oh, Dexter takes him out. But You know, when he sees two targets flying over towards him, does he really expect there to be three people in Palace? I certainly wouldn't. Bit though, that's a double kill from him and that's probably the most impact he's had all game. Dexter trades him on out. A Molotov to follow down towards... Ooh, the underpass is Chopper. Sam Da Young, find a kill apiece. Block will do just fine for him. And now, Na'Vi, with a great gamble towards B right here. But it is still a two versus three. And Sam Da Young is going to... Oh, Whoa! simple! Going to find a quick scope for the Sam Da Young. Perfecto takes out Chopper and Dexter with a trade. But Perfecto going to take him out. And what a beautiful gamble stack of Na'Vi towards B. You know, that's potential util. Even so, Dexter will open up onto Simple, and my words will be eaten. Boomich and Electronic, though, they find another one each. Still a four versus three for Navi, and without that AK-47, it is just the pistols to run Riot. Oh, what a pistol frag right here. Thanks a bit. Team Spirit going towards A, and... Na'Vi, they had a great stack towards A, but yeah. 15 Spirit waiting so long. They are finally going to come here and two players fell off. Boomage goes down and now Na'Vi with their backs against the walls in a two versus three. Perfecto here from the CD spawn. Electronic goes down and connector and now Perfecto in a one versus three. He sees the foot. Falling apart for Na'Vi, finds the first and... Oh, Sumta Young behind the boxes, a player in connector as well. Perfecto, tapping away, but can't quite find a kill, and I'm gonna run out of builds, three builds right now in his M4, and this may be too little too late here. Not gonna find anything, and Team Spirit come out ahead. 
It's a thirteen brown. Yeah, magic's now. I'm gonna throw the molly in towards the default boom, but she's gonna burn alive. Now, oh, four versus five. Oh, simple. That's gonna fire Murdo. Makes it a four versus four. Picks up the AK 47, and something can still come out of this round. Chopper can get flashed in towards CD spawn. Bit finds Dexter. Simple. Takes out magic, said Chopper. With a trade, but the kill advantage is going towards Navi. Or now, in a three versus two. They do, of course, don't have a diffuse kit. The chopper. Some die young with a crossfire. Electronic goes down and some die young now. In a one versus two, but Bit comes out ahead. Simple takes out chopper. That's gonna be the 12th round for Navi. Window holding on to middle, but Team Spirit are looking to go towards his B site. Perfecto is here with the MP9. Oh my lord, if some die young comes out with a peek, he could save this, but chopper finds a save himself and now Team Spirit. In a three versus three, we'll get the bomb down and Navi have to retake this. Bit is the first man on the scene. He's looking to push through market, but the smoke will potentially deter him. But no, it doesn't deter him. Some Dayong sees a foot, simple to trade, but magic holds the cross. Boomage will fall and now in the one versus two, it's all down again. To the number one in the world Ooh. and he finds some Dayong. He could have stuck the defuse. He doesn't want to. Knows where the last player is. Goes back with a Desert Eagle. Magix has to swing and he finds a headshot onto Simple. Spirit retain their two-round lead. Maybe yeah. they're just that confident in their abilities on the Desert Eagles that they that they think they can win this one against the rivals. And Bits trying to start off strong. Oh, no. That doesn't get the opportunity to use it as a shotgun as Magic swings on in. Electronic, though. Oh, my goodness, Electronic. He's going back for more, but it's Dexter to deny. Three versus three. It's still definitely a possibility for Na'Vi in this one. Chopper, he's in the window. Perfecto will hear that drop. He goes in for a quick peek, but he's not quite round enough the corner to find the shot. Look at Simple, though. He's in the ninja boost. This could be a make or break round. Simple finds the first. Can he pick up the second? No. It's Sunday Young to deny. It's all down to Boomer. She will fall. And Spirit find a 15th round on the board. They lead by three. And the economy of Navi is in tatters. If he doesn't get cleared by the Molotov, then he could go absolutely super saiyan here. Instead, Sunday Young finds ahead a bit. And now we're down to the three versus three. Boomich needs to go huge. Oh, oh dear. Needs to go huge, but can he? Doesn't look like it in that instance. And now Simple and Perfecto have to find three kills in a defuse. They don't even have a defuse kit right now. You can see Perfecto. He knows. He knows he has to push into this one. He's going to be throwing a smoke on the bomb. That is going to help them out a lot if they can actually get towards that bomb. Because Dexter holding out a cross. And now Perfecto, one versus three, can find a first one deep. Doesn't have the few skits, so goes down to Dexter. And that's going to be 16 to 12 for Team Spirit on the first map. But at the same time, I hope Na'Vi can pull their way back into things. Yeah, it would be great for this one to be a 2-1 either way. Electronic going to find the opener onto Dexter. Now Bit is here as well. Electronic looking to find a second, but Perfecto coming in to find two of himself. Make that <laughs> third. What a B-site hold here from Na'Vi. This is definitely the start that they needed. Don't you worry, man. I got you. Now Dexter. Ooh, he's going in quite aggressive. This is why you don't want to have a fan mask. Dexter! That is a one tap and a half. Well, there was a few taps, but only one tap needed for that kill. Perfecto now on the B side has to hold on to this one. Three versus five. Now Team Spirit. A lot of these players have been softened up. Dexter on 18. They're on 62. But now Perfecto. Can he find the incredible spray down? Well, actually, it's not going for it. He's waiting. But oh, Ooh. the whiff. Can't quite find the first headshot and gets punished for that An electronic and boom, which now have to go for the save. But Spirit win round number three with five players surviving after a couple of saucy antics towards the double doors. And it finds some Dai Young down to 18 points of health. Chopper though sees the head, tries to go for the frag, can't quite capitalize as he ducks back down behind the wall. Electronic will remain hidden bit though with a jumping CZ finds me a chopper, doubles up on the Galil. Now the two versus two, he looks for more. It's all down to Boomich on the M4 and the IGL comes out on top with a 3k in round number four. So at least he does a decent amount of damage, but without that kill, it's a severe advantage for Team Spirit, especially on a map like Dust 2, where it's so difficult to rotate on over, but Boomich doesn't seem to care. He decapitates Mir, 
Now, Perfecto has a lot to do on his own MP9. Again, he won't be able to. Bit instead is the man to find a frag. And he hops up towards Window. He's still able to do something in this round, but he runs into a crossfire chopper from top mid. He's Boomage in a one versus three. And I feel like Team Spirit stand a pretty strong chance of taking round number five here. Yeah, unless Boombitch goes absolutely Super Saiyan. Dexter with the Krieg. Well, you can see what they are able to do right here. Now, Navi will be forcing right up into this one. Let's see if that will work out for the mess. Some that young finds bit. Five versus four, and Spectre does find one, but in the end, Navi, two versus four. Yeah, how much can a pistol really do against AKs at that medium type of range? Boomage now with another CZ rushing on in the back lines. Even bag some free utility off the floor. And Boomage is about to get pushed by Mir. Is he going to check this angle properly? They are just half a oh. centimeter from seeing each other. He himself is going to be smoking towards short to give himself a bit of cover as this execute comes on in and simple. Spams on down. Magic's to 52. It is still a four versus five, though, and Na'Vi have a lot of weight on their shoulders. Magic's here looking to play a bit too aggressive, perhaps. I mean, this could go his way or it could go against him. We're going to find a person to simple. Here it takes a bit, but he finds one himself with electronic now and one versus four. Maybe too little, too late. Team Spirit. And Magic's now, he's out into the fray of things, is full blinded, can't see Bit crossing in towards Pit, and that grenade does surprisingly little damage as now the onslaught opens up. Bit is able to find one, the spray transfer is almost incredible, but it only does damage rather than seal oh. the deal. Electronic dies to the fire, and now the two versus three again for Na'Vi has to come through, otherwise their economy will be shattered. And simple two and seven on this one. Not looking as hot as he did on the latter stages of Mirage. Vector, that's a great frag from him. But oh, dearie me, Chopper through the smoke. Sends him packing and now simple. He's done miraculous things with an AWP on this A-long position before. Can he do it again? As I believe that's more T-utility burning themselves. Simple. Oh, gonna find the no-scope onto Dexter. <laughs> the no-scope headshot now in a one versus one. Can he get this oh! one? Simple with the two no-scope clutch. Gonna find round number four for Na'Vi. What a way to do it in. Magic's here is gonna give a hug to Perfecto, perhaps. Oh, gonna give the footsteps away. Perfecto finds the headshot onto Magic's and now. Down a four versus four, but Team Spirit needs a side. Oh, they are going to have to retake this one. Yeah, and with the bomb already ticking down, only one defuse get on Perfecto. They need to make sure he manages to get up to this bomb site. This is a brutal crossfire. One on long, one on ramp, one by car. And Someday Young, oh my goodness! Someday Young is just another day at the Rangers playing whack a mole on short. Three stellar headshots all lined up in a row. Wishing we had replays for that because I want to know what the hell happened here. Oh, they have to, uh, go, what you they doing, have to go down at the HLTV VOD after this game to watch. Skins don't necessarily equal wins here, ladies and gents. Equal skill. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it feels that way sometimes. Now, Beard with the op. He's going to find the opener onto Magics. That was quite magical, to say the least. Now, Team Spirit. They are still looking to come towards the B side. Bit is going to get Molly out of position. Perfecto finds one, but Mir with the trade and out. That is a B side. Him control of Spirit and oh, Chopper. No! Oh my lord. Get to the Chopper after that one. Simple. Does come in. Find another quick scope. This is going to get shot down by Dexter, though, with the P250. Dexter doesn't want to go for any no scopes. He's just going to take out the P250 and take down the threat. They're going to be desperate for it at this point. They've not had a good showing on this second map. Simple, though. Doesn't miss twice. Finds Magic, so now a two-man advantage for Na'Vi. We can't rule Spirit out just yet. But Na'Vi look like they might have just been able to do enough as all the Spirit congregate towards middle to devolve a new strategy. They are looking to go towards B, though, and we have seen what they can do right there. Electronic. Alright, he's behind. Oh, I was gonna say, alright, he's behind the box, but no, he was in front. The X-ray was baiting me right there. 
Gonna find a kill on the chopper, and now some uh, young Amir all Ooh. going towards a uh, simple dip here. Nice flick right there. Amir is gonna be killing himself, so that is gonna make sure he gets a little bit less money. But in the end, it's the final round of the half. My bad. Some that young goes no. out a bit. Yeah. He dies because Simple hits him in the leg midair and he tries yeah, to avoid any more shots and he just falls towards CT to his death. They had the right idea with the run boost, but Simple is just too good on the AWP. Then why not give it a go with parry match? But please do remember to gamble oh, responsibly. Dexter. And dearie me, Dexter, he's going to be gifted a lot here. Find Simple as well, falls away. He could be on for more, but it's Perfecto and Boomich to trade and deny. But look at the health on Boomage Bit and Perfecto. One grenade is all it takes, and it kills Boomage Bit. Narrowly avoids the same fate. Is it's now a two versus three because it's the pissed around. There is still hope for Perfecto and Bit. Some like young now holding the perfect cross. Must have aim a little bit lower, but I'm sure he can <laughs> transfer that one. It shot on to Bit and Team Spirit. We may have to call the Bully Hunters because they're absolutely bullying. Navi, we may also yeah, need some bully hunters for the chat today. <laughs> Deary me, but Perfecto, either way, needs to get this bomb plant for the team. And good lord, what a spinning headshot onto Chopper. Lands it and finds a gorgeous frag. There is still the opportunity here for a bomb plant. And whilst the round may or may not be won by Perfecto, at least they will have the money to well, pull off a bit of a better fight in the next. Magic swings on in. Perfecto won't actually get the plant. Buy of Navi is a bit better, but of course, Dexter currently on that AWP right now, and that knee definitely not going to help because Sunday Young with the MP9. Oh, perfecto. Absolutely going to destroy him. Now it's going to be down to Mir here to hold things down. Dexter finds his kill to boom, but Mir finds oh, another no. fight a second and a turn. Oh, Mir! Got to find oh. this one right here, and Navi have been absolutely deleted by Mir. This is the same story for the rest of this round that I seriously fear for Navi. Yeah, I'm starting to fear as well, or well, let's say I was fearing for them in about round number five of the last map. Now, they are doing some economical damage with these eagles, but with 35 seconds left, they don't have much time to play with. They have to come in right now because Team Spirit will be trying to ruin the efforts of Na'Vi. Bit is going to take out Chopper, but Spirit are going to keep progressing here towards short. Magix finds Boombitch, and with 22 seconds left, Na'Vi now have to go to the side. Okay, they are going to get on A, so the time is not going to matter too much, so it is going to be down to the retake. And we do see that Bit is on the other side, but that doesn't matter. Simple finds Dexter, and Bit, he could be putting the final nail in the coffin soon. It took them a horrendously long time to put that sixth on the board. If they continue in this fashion, it could be a 2 for Spirit. But now we see glimmers of life with Na'Vi. Are we going to see replication? Na'Vi, they're still all over the place. Yeah, I mean, they need to group up now. It looks like they're still defaulting, but as soon as I say oh. that, Perfecto and Simple... Smash the pieces, Mir and Dexter. That's two heavy hitters removed from the Spirit Squad, and I think another save call might be coming in, but look where Electronic is hiding. I don't know if Magix will be expecting this, and Electronic sees the head, sees the frag, finds the double as Chopper misses, misses the shot on the AWP. I mean... Please. Time out would just give you more time. Now Magix... Or, well, Chopper is going to find a headshot on the Boombitch. And look at this. Oh, no. Bit. What a kill into some that young Dexter. Can you hold on to this? He's going to find Simple. Simple has been absolutely great in the last couple of rounds. Now we are on a three versus three. Team Spirit. Will they expect Mir to come in from here? They're not holding him right now. Electronic to go down. And now, Navi. Can they hold on to this? Mir is going to find oh, Bit no. and Perfecto now. Look at where Perfecto is. Adding insult to injury. The bomb is being defused. And this is going to be serious points secured for Team Spirit. Definitely with their backs against the wall. Simple has to show up right here. I hate to say that he has to show up, but it really does. Now Bit finds dear. the one for one trade. Dexter is going to hold this cross. And Navi, they do have the two smokes, but this is going to be a hard one. Yeah, I mean, they're gearing up for the cross. They have to go for the cross now. Boomich picks up a smoke off of his fallen teammate, and that will at least net them 
a little in this round. I'd say a Molotov towards CT at this point would be a good play from them. But they're going very, very slowly. And instead, it's a Molotov towards Ramp to either speed the T's up into an aggressive fight. And that's exactly what happens. Boomich will fall. Chopper finds a head. And now he's looking for more. Sees one to car. Perfecto on the ramp. He's trying everything he can to deal with Chopper. And Simple is set through the boxes to man to find the frag. Two versus three. Mir still holding from Elevator. Hasn't been gifted anything just yet. No line of sight. As Simple finds one more. He's not able to find the last, though. It's now a one versus two for Perfecto. He's done well so far in this game. Goes for the fake plant. And, and Orp is hey, on the top. It's Mir instead. The Orp was just a mere distraction. As Mir himself is the one to find the final frag. And Navi, they fall flat again.